File overview. The Foundation is not the only group with an interest and investment in the paranormal and metaphysical. There are many other groups in existence who possess, use, or attempt to create SCP objects, either for their own personal gain or for the protection of mankind. Some are rival organizations, some are splinter groups of the Foundation, and some are trusted associates of the Foundation. In any case, it has been deemed necessary to create and distribute a brief on what agencies the Foundation knows about and our stance towards them. Office for the Reclamation of Islamic Artifacts Aurea Overview The Office for the Reclamation of Islamic Artifacts Aurea is a paramilitary force answerable only to the Supreme Leader of Iran, dedicated to the collection and utilization of anomalous artifacts throughout the Middle East and Central Asia. Following the 1979 overthrow of the Imperial Iranian government by revolutionary forces and subsequent creation of the Islamic Republic of Iran, all Foundation personnel were expelled from Iran as agents of colonialism. Attempts at maintaining a clandestine presence in the country met with failure, with the majority of Foundation personnel either captured or killed, and sites and being captured by Iranian forces. To prevent Iran from being left behind in the field of extranormal research, the Aurea was created by a secret decree of Supreme Leader Khomeini in 1981. Despite its name, the group has not limited itself to the pursuit of anomalous objects of Islamic origin. Although the Aurea has access to considerable resources, its effectiveness is hobbled by infighting among numerous factions within the organization. Some of these disputes center around philosophical differences, such as weaponization of anomalous objects, while others appear to be personal in nature. The proliferation of factions appears to have been intentional, as the organization of the Aurea often leaves multiple commanders with overlapping areas of responsibility. It is theorized that the reasoning behind this arrangement was to prevent any one individual from accumulating enough power to pose a challenge to the supreme leader. With the spread of Iranian hegemony throughout the Middle East and Western Asia, the Aurea has expanded its reach across the region, becoming the foremost paranormal organization in the Middle East. The Aurea is to be considered a hostile force, and Foundation personnel are advised to use extreme caution when engaging. Oniroi Collective Overview Information about the Oniroi Collective has come to the Foundation only through analysis and interviews, or the anomalous objects they leave behind. It is believed to be a collective consciousness of dreaming persons and dream-based entities. Intelligence has shown that they have been documented by other groups of interest, usually to a degree similar to the Foundation's interaction. The Oniroi Collective is apparently capable of contacting even highly isolated entities, e.g. nobody. Their goals, if any exist, are currently unknown. Parawatch Overview The Parawatch Wiki is an online web forum of conspiracy theorists, paranormal enthusiasts, and amateur writers operating with the intent of investigating and exposing anomalous phenomena. The group primarily compiles short stories on the forum, detailing encounters with paranormal phenomena, historical cases, and any unusual events users have experienced. Further operation and any potential impact on normalcy is hindered by the geographic spread of the user base and the lack of central coordination. Despite investment in the paranormal, Parawatch has no knowledge on the nature of anomalous phenomena, the veil, and the Foundation's existence. This, in tandem with public obscurity, has prevented them from potentially endangering the veil. The group is currently being left active as a means of misinforming and misleading other investigations into the anomalous. Prometheus Labs Inc. Overview Founded in 1892, Prometheus Labs was dedicated to researching anomalous objects for use in developing new technologies. Over the years, Prometheus Labs developed into a multinational conglomerate selling advanced and anomalous technologies to governments, militaries, and groups of interest. Throughout its history, Prometheus Labs displayed a nominal amount of cooperation with Foundation efforts to protect normalcy, and at times, even collaborated with the Foundation, but refused to cease its studies of anomalies and resisted Foundation oversight. In 1998, following a long period of financial decline, the Prometheus Labs conglomerate was dissolved resulting in the creation of numerous successor companies formed from its subsidiaries. 
the breakup of the conglomerate was fraught with technical and administrative difficulties, resulting in the loss of many products and the layoffs of numerous personnel. Most of the former projects of Prometheus Labs now in containment were recovered during this time, and many of its former employees were hired by the Foundation. End of file. To learn more about the SCP Foundation, subscribe to SCP Orientation today and turn the notification bell on so you don't miss any of our videos.